Hunter, are you having fun? Yeah! Okay. going to start the vlog here it is about let's see 9 30 in the morning um we had a little bit of a rough morning waking up and doing breakfast and whatnot so that's why I'm starting the vlog now but we all got dressed we're all wearing like cozy warm sweaters Paxton has this little football red one on and Hunter has this dinosaur one on <laughs> Yeah, it says, hear me roar. <laughs> so yeah, we're just nice, warm, and cozy right now. Um, as you can see, behind me I have a lot of laundry to fold. I have this big pile and then this hamper full of clothes. Um, because I did laundry the past two days. Anyway... My name is Agnes. I have two little boys, as you just saw. They are four and a half and one, so fun ages to be around and learn new things from, and they learn from us and whatnot. But if you like day in the life vlogs, weekly vlogs, um, a little bit of cook with me's and clean with me's, go subscribe to my channel. If you like day in the life, like this one because this is going to be a day in the life video. And yeah. Let's just get along with our day. So as I've said on my channel before, my mom goes to our library and she gets these bags um, just full of activities for the kids. And then there's ones like these, which something is coming out of. So she gets these different ones every time um, just so the kids have something to do every week, something different and fun. So. We are going to open them right now. I'm so excited to see a new Alright, so in this bag, it looks like you have these at school. You, you got these magnet wands at school, right? Mm -hmm. So it's these magnet wands, and then it comes with like little chips here, um, little magnet balls, and some other kind of magnets. So, oh, and a oh shoot magnet. So that's gonna be fun to do. This is what the box looks like, and all of these books. And then yeah, it comes with some magnet books. So that's kind of cool. Are you Alright, now we are going to open this one and see what's inside of there. Ready? 
what is that? So this, watch out, baby. We can put slime in there. So this comes with these giant teeth and a giant toothbrush. So I guess like to learn how to brush your teeth. That's pretty cool. You want to brush the teeth and you want to be the mouth. <laughs> Also a couple books. Ooh, a Daniel Tiger. So there's a Daniel Tiger going to the dentist. Um, a brush your teeth book, and then visiting the dentist. So this bag is just all about the dentist and keeping your teeth clean. Yeah, so yeah, right. we're just gonna sit here, play with this stuff for a little bit, and then. I don't know, it'll probably be lunchtime by then, or at least close to lunchtime. I'm sorry about this lighting. My face is very bright right now. When the sun is out, I like to use natural lighting to light the room instead of turning the lamp on. So, anyway, yeah, we're just gonna play for now. <laughs> So we had the idea of putting Play-Doh in the teeth, that way they could brush something out um, and just make it a little more fun. So we're going to take turns now and brush the food out. Use the toothbrush. Yeah, scrub, scrub, scrub. Like this. Like this. Yeah, there you go. Yay. We got to get it out of his mouth. He's eating? Uh-huh. No, 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 Look what no, this no. kid does to his hair. Turn your head. Look at Hunter. What? He likes to sit there and um, twirl his hair. And it just gets so knotted when he does that. And his, sometimes his finger gets caught in his hair and then he cries. We had fun with that. Um, they're kind of bored with it already, but they'll be interested again tomorrow, so it's whatever. It's just a fun little activity for them to do. Um, I am sorry about my voice. I am still getting over the sickness from when I got sick on Christmas. I hate being sick. So at the beginning of this video, um, I inserted just a few clips of what I was doing on... I think it was Sunday. I was just like organizing some things and then I was writing down, okay, don't hit the floor. And then I sat down with my planner and I just wrote down um, this week's goals and like priorities that need to be done. And like I meal planned and whatnot. So that's a new thing that we're trying. We're trying to meal plan. That way maybe we could save a little bit of money on groceries instead of um, like going to the store and like mindlessly shopping for food. Hi. 
So yeah, that's what we're doing. We're trying to meal plan and see if it helps anything. The rest of the day is just going to be um, hanging out with the kids, playing. Uh, we're going to do lunch. I think, I think I did this in my last vlog too, but I think we're going to have tuna with crackers. Um, we don't have cucumber this time, but uh, we have green peppers. So I think we're going to do that for lunch. Just need to fold laundry. Uh, get some editing done, and that's our day pretty much. But I'll bring you along for a little bit more of it. So sit back and enjoy. So this is the problem with these bags. They only come with a certain amount of things and this is what happens because one of them doesn't want to share and one of them always takes everything. So this is what we deal with but we always need to share guys, right? Paxton, you have a lot of wands right here. You have two. And there's extras right here. And you have a lot of coins. All right. You play over here. Hunter plays over there. Especially with this. They were fighting over this because obviously there's only one mouth and one toothbrush. So this is hard <laughs> to share for them as well. But... We deal with it, we figure it out, and we talk about sharing, and sometimes we just need to separate them, and that's fine. It all works out just fine. But while they play, I'm going to warm up my coffee again. Because I let it get cold, as usual. But I can't put this mug in the microwave, so I need to pour it in a different mug. All right, so before I had kids, um, I wanted to become a preschool teacher, and so I took some early childhood education classes, and in one of the classes, we had to come up with a bunch of different activities to do, and this was one of them that I made. Um, I thought of it all by myself, and I drew these out. And there's double pictures because one says the animal name and then one says an action that they have to do. And Hunter likes to hide one of these while I keep the other one. And then he goes and finds it. And then he brings it back and does the action and tells me what kind of animal is in the picture. So I have a whole thing here of different activities. Those all by yourself nobody helped you. Yep, nobody helped me. And I made all these activities here. Um, some of them are felt. This is one of my favorite ones. I made these. I sewed these all together. I made these cute little finger puppets. What are these? Those were the ones that I didn't finish. This was supposed to be a sheep, and then this was supposed to be a goat or something. I didn't get to finish them, but I thought these were so cute. I uh, yeah, touched a uh, uh, was done. Then you... Uh, but yeah, there's some more felt ones. This one, I made a little mouse. My eyes fell off. But that was for Hickory Dickory Dock. Um, then there's some more felt ones, and then there's more laminated activity ones. This one's a color matching game for if you give a mouse a cookie. So that's what that is. Um, that is what I did in school when I went to school. Um, and we're just going to do this project now. 
for this activity. snuck into the bathroom to hop on and talk for a little bit um i just put them down for a nap they had their lunch and everything so they're all set and hopefully they take a good nap because i need to fold clothes i did the dishes while they were eating lunch and watching a movie so that's all done so i just need to fold clothes and edit and I think that's it. Maybe I'll prep dinner a little bit if I have time before they wake up. And then when they wake up, um, we're going to do another little activity with the magnets that they got. And you saw this morning um, because we read a magnet book for nap time and Hunter wants to do some of the experiments that were in it. Which is fine, um, it gives us another activity to do today. So I guess today is going to be all about magnets, which Hunter enjoys because he loves those magnet tiles. He just, he's in love with those. He Every time I pick him up from school, that's what he's playing with. So <laughs> while they nap, I usually eat my lunch so I could just have my lunch in quiet and enjoy my lunch. So I'm going to go eat some lunch, make another cup of coffee, and I don't know, watch YouTube or Netflix or something. So that's my plan for now. All right, so the boys have been up for like, probably like an hour and a half now. Um, my hair is so weird sometimes. Um, anyway, we are going to do our little science experiment now and then I need to start dinner and I still need to fold those clothes back there because I took my time eating my lunch and I just enjoyed having the quiet. So um, just took a little bit longer for myself to have me time and then I started editing and getting that done. I'm still not done editing, but I'm editing this video that you're watching right now. Um, hopefully I could get it edited tonight so it can go up tomorrow. Tomorrow is Wednesday. That's when I usually post a video. So crossing my fingers I could get it done, but if not, it will go up Thursday. So whenever you're watching this, Thank you for watching and we're going to hop right into our science experiment. All right, so for this little experiment, we have the coins that came in the bag, the little balls that came in the bag, and um, these little magnets that also came in the bag. And then we have my hair tie, a screw, a paper clip, a nail, and a puzzle piece and also this necklace we're going to try and yeah we're going to see what sticks to our magnet wand all right so let's see what do you think the what what do you think will stick to the magnets okay so the ball sticks to the magnet oh our magnets stick to the magnet Okay, and these little chips stick to the magnet. How about my hair tie? Do you think that will stick? Nope. Is it sticking? No. Nope. So the hair tie doesn't work. How about... Whoops. How about this nail? Will that stick to your magnet? I want to do the 
Okay. Okay, here. Does it stick? Mm-hmm. Yep. That's stuck to the magnet. Okay. How about this nail? That one sticks. How about this puzzle piece? Nope. That does not stick. Because that is a piece of... What? Cardboard. How about this paper clip? Alright, so I'm in the kitchen now. I am making dinner, but I also wanted to just hop on here. I am going to be ending the vlog, but I wanted to say that if you watched my um, New Year's goals video, um, I can link it here. But, uh, why am I pointing with a knife? It's not very nice. If you watched that, I said that one of my goals and like the hardest goal for me will be waking up before my kids. And I was totally right. I knew it was going to be super hard. I don't even know how long ago I said that, like two weeks ago or something. And yeah, like I just can't do it. I cannot wake up early. I have been setting alarms for like 6.15ish. Um, there were times where I woke up at like 6.30 or 6.40. Um, mainly on Mondays and Fridays because those are school days for Hunter. And I have to wake up early to get him up early. But, yeah, it, like, it's hard, and I feel like I'm failing myself, but I don't know. Tomorrow's Wednesday, so John is off work, but, oh, I forgot he has to go do something, so he won't be here in the morning, but I was going to try to, um, wake up early tomorrow, and I thought it would be easier since he would still be in the bed. Um, this little guy here... He wakes up like around 5 o'clock and just starts kicking and getting fussy and yeah so that's the time that John wakes up every day to go to work or like to get ready for work and like it's hard because by the time I try to get him back to sleep I want to sleep for like five more minutes but that five minutes turns into like a half hour or like another hour and then both of the boys wake up and I didn't get a chance to wake up before them so I don't know maybe I will try tomorrow um, to wake up early I don't know I keep telling myself every day like I'm gonna do this I have so much confidence in myself at night and then when he starts kicking at 5 a.m. it's like nope I'm not getting up <laughs> But if I had that hour of sleep from like 5 to 6, I think I'd be okay. So I don't know. But we're going to try. Right? We're going to try. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I'm just making dinner here. Does anybody else like the smell of garlic and onions cooking? Because it smells amazing in my house right now. For dinner, we're just having unstuffed stuffed peppers. <laughs> if that makes sense and if you have heard of that um we've never tried it so it's something new for us i have had stuffed peppers before but they're just kind of hard to eat especially for the kids so i decided to try this version it's just all in a pan pretty much everything that's in a stuffed pepper just all broken down and cut up so that's what we're having and instead of beef we're using ground turkey because I prefer ground turkey. So yeah, that's what we're having. If you like this day in the life video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you would like to. What's going on here? <laughs> and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Say bye. Say bye bye. Say bye guys. Say thumbs up. No. Alright. <laughs> Bye guys.